Slime in the ice machine. It has been a part of Houston's vocabulary for decades now. But have you ever actually seen what that slime looks like in its natural habitat? Well, tonight we're taking you inside filthy restaurant ice machines, revealing just how slime ends up in your drink. Investigator Bill Spencer reveals the risks to your health and what steps restaurants must take to keep ice machines clean and safe. Slime is gross. It is grimy. Green and gooey and slick. Green stuff that is bad for you. I think it's repugnant. Slime in the ice machine. It is one of the ugliest, most disgusting, stomach-turning things you will ever find in any restaurant. Houstonians have been hearing about it for decades. Slime in the ice machine. And yet the wild part is most of us have never actually seen what it really looks like. Well, here it is in all of its grossness, black slime, orange slime, yellow slime, green slime. Andy Spellens runs QBR Refrigeration, a company that specializes in cleaning ice machines for restaurants. He gave us dozens and dozens of pictures of ice machines his employees have had to scrub out. And he understands like nobody else why slime is such a big deal. Why should we care about slime being in that machine? Because ice machine, ice is the most important food product in a restaurant. Uh, it's in every drink, it's at every table. Think about that. Every single drink made with ice, water, soft drinks, and cocktails. Andy, where are we gonna find slime in this machine? Basically, you'll find the slime in the ice cavity. That's right here, where the ice starts to drop from the machine. In fact, slime in the ice machine, if not taken care of, can get so bad, it can actually start forming these greasy, gross, gooey-like fingers that hang above the ice, and then that slime can fall into the ice, which is then gonna go into your drink. Can actually grow like a worm. And cleaning that ice machine is a whole lot of work. First, you have to dump out all of the ice. Then scrub the pipes, the tubes, the plastic surfaces. And finally sanitize with a slime killer. I usually like to use the nickel safe ice machine clear. They'll uh, take off all the slime and all the mold. At Bolo Wood Fired Pizza in Upper Kirby, owner Ray Salty has 27 years in the restaurant business, and he knows the only way to keep slime from growing is to clean that machine at least once a week with a high intense cleaning once a month. If you have a dirty ice machine, you're gonna make a lot of people sick. It will make you, you know, vomit. It could cause diarrhea, bad stuff. Slime in the ice machine is a critical violation because it is a dirty food contact surface. At the Houston Health Department, restaurant inspectors take slime in the ice machine very seriously because they know it's dangerous and can cause foodborne illness. How prevalent is slime in the ice machine? I mean, how often do you find it? We'll see it anywhere between um, 50 to 100 times a month um, in, in, during our inspections. It's a good thing Houston restaurant inspectors are out there because you can't inspect the ice machine yourself as a customer. And it's very unlikely you'll ever see it or taste it. As my sister in California would say, gross. <laughs> Now, not all cases of slime in the ice machine are as bad as what you just saw. Those are extreme cases, but they are real cases from real restaurants. And speaking of ice machines, what about the ice machine you have at your workplace? Wouldn't you like to know how to check that machine for slime? We've got you covered. We've created a special instructional video on how to do it on our website at clicktohouston.com. Just go to the consumer tab. We also have dozens of pictures, probably way too many, of <laughs> slime in the ice machine for you to look at. That was my first question to Bill. What about the Channel 2 ice machine? I have well, an ice, ice cruncher. I don't think new. I want to know. <laughs> ours is brand new, so probably not a problem. But yeah. don't you know, as much as we Houstonians eat out, every single one of us has encountered this problem at sure. some time or another. Yeah, it's Had important. ice that came from a slimy machine. Uh, yes. With legs. With legs and arms and gooey worm-like things. Thank you. Marvin <laughs> Zindler is smiling right he now. He is. Somewhere. He's very proud of that report. Let's Thank move you, on to happier subjects. <laughs>